Greetings, my earthlings. Welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can already tell by the topic, we're going to dive into something. This is just a quick little teaser. I'm not going to give you guys the full entree. This is just a little appetizer of what is to come. I want to dive deeper into this topic as you can tell why more women are becoming more content the older that they get with being single and not finding that quote unquote happy ending. This is something that I've been wanting to talk about for a while. We're gonna dive a little deep into it right now. It's just a little teaser. And before we jump into the video, please don't forget to like, don't forget to comment, don't forget to subscribe. And most importantly, hit that notification bell if you want to be up to date on all of my latest posts, all of my latest videos. And speaking of posts, if you would love to follow me on social media, please check out my stuff in the description box below or I will simply paste it here at the bottom of the screen. You can follow your girl on IG, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat. I'm on it all. Mostly on IG though, mostly on TikTok. But anyway, without further ado, let's jump into this video, all right? As you can see by the title, I just wanted to do a deeper dive. This is going to be a quick little segment. I'm not going to get too into it, but I was just thinking, if you really think about it, most women in their 30s, well, I would say maybe late 30s, early 40s, you see these cougars and stuff and you wonder why certain women get to a point in their life where they're just like, all I need a man for is just that good, good in his finances and most guys get so triggered by that like that's all women i feel like with women at a certain point after being disappointed or being in certain relationships where they really did give their all and they wanted something meaning meaningful from that relationship they end up getting to a point where they're just like f it forget it this is all i need a man for and not in, and sometimes it may not even be that sometimes it could be from a number of things to where they're in life they may be thriving they're a boss they ain't got time for the mind games they don't have time for all of the extra they they just get to a certain point and usually it happens around the age of 35 to 40 like you know 40 and beyond where they just realize like I don't want to be tied down in a relationship it's truly a lot more women like that than you think and I'm not let's not get it twisted here I'm not talking about the gold diggers the ones who go out and seek men only for money but I'm talking about the women once they get to a certain age they're like if a man comes around, that's cool. I'm not gonna go seeking it, but this is what I want out of the relationship. You know, sometimes you have alpha females who are very busy. They're just, you know, they got their life ahead of them. They got so many, so many plans and stuff that they're like, hey, I'm in this moment in my life to where if anyone wants to add to it, that's fine, but this is what I need you to add. I don't need anything serious. I don't need anything deep because I feel like some women, they feel like they may be possibly wasting their time trying to find a guy who's um, highly intellectual, highly into them and having that deep soul connection. I feel like once they get to that certain age, and again, this is not all women, it's just some women. For those who are curious to like, why am I running into certain women like that? Or why am I hearing that certain women, once they reach this particular age, this is all they think about? And why is it harder for women to, I don't want to say harder, but why is it more common for women to not want to settle down? <laughs> you know, quote unquote, settle down once they get to that particular age. And sometimes you may find men like that too. Um, but right now the topic is women why they decide that once they reach that age that 30 ish 40 ish age to where they're like look i only want a man only for pleasure or for finances anything far as love or anything far as a life partner is not on the table i don't see it in my cards um i just wanted to dive deeper into that and also just kind of 
give you guys a few things to think about as well as to why certain women may <laughs> be at that point um i've used myself for an, as an example i not at that point yet but i can kind of see myself slowly going into that direction um possibly once i hit like age 28 <laughs> from 28 to now it's like look that fairy tale ending is it totally is it totally like a no for me to where it's like i don't want this super fairy tale little i don't want to say it's totally gone because i'm very optimistic anyone who knows me knows that i am an aquarius and we're going to be very optimistic but we're also realist and with being a realist you also have that realization of hey this is where i'm at in life and i'm okay with it more and more women are okay with being a i don't want to say alone but having that freedom of being single and they are loving it and being at peace with being single and i think i'm at that point you know will that change years from now yeah possibly um i want to dive deeper into this topic right now i just wanted to give you guys just a little <laughs> just a little kind of teaser of this topic if you guys want to weigh in on it definitely write down in the comment section below on why you think certain women once they reach a certain age they become more content with being single and if they do want a companion or a man why they only want them for pleasure and for finances and not for the deeper connection that they so once wanted when they were younger you know i feel like this is a good topic um certain people do talk about it but i want to dive deeper into this so right now i was just giving you guys just something to kind of hold on to until i make a complete video but i had to talk about it while it was on my mind you guys i'm gonna come up with some pointers come up with a few things so we can really really dive deeper into this okay um but anyway you guys thank you so much for tuning in um let me know in the comment section below don't forget to follow your girl on all social media platforms um twitter facebook ig especially ig especially tiktok as well because those are the two sites that i am on most of the time snapchat every now and then um follow your girl it will be in the description box below don't forget to like please hit the notification bell so you can be updated on all of my latest posts i love you guys i will have more sit down and chat videos we're going to dive deeper into this topic i am going to post another video so make sure you stay tuned okay you guys i love you and i am out bye